Okay, this is a simulated arcing inside of the uh, microwave before I uh, uh, attempted to uh, eliminate or alleviate that uh, problem. Okay, I'm going to see uh, what's, uh, what's going on with my uh, microwave here. It has been arcing on the inside here. So, uh, as a YouTube video, I watched that uh, said to remove that plate inside there. And, uh, and you see where the arcing is right there. So, I'm going to clean that area up right there. And uh, also this plate right here. This plate right there shows where some arcing has been on the plate. So I am going to take a few minutes here and clean that plate off there and replace it and see if cleaning that plate will reduce the arcing or completely uh, eliminate it. All right, but before you do it, make sure your microwave is unplugged and uh, it's in a safe condition to work on it. So I'm going to pause the video right here and uh, clean off these, this area there inside and this area here and replace it and see if the arcing has dissipated. Okay, so I, I scraped some of the uh, burnt uh, let's see the arcing from the inside there and uh, also you can see down in the floor let's see down on the floor there you can see that little shiny stuff down there you can see here that stuff right there now that came from that came from That came from this here. Okay, the arcing on there. See the arcing on there has caused has, has made a small hole uh, directly through there. This small hole right there, but it's uh, cleaned it up there. That all that burnt area there. That's what the other side looks like. Well, the other side looks okay. So I'm gonna scrape a little bit more. But when I put this back in there. I'm going to reverse it such that the where the hole was there, I did that arc, that little space over there. I'm going to I'm going to move that uh, flip over this panel here so that that there won't be a hole where the arcing was. All right, let's see how that works. Okay, after you've uh, cleaned out the inside, it's nice to have one of these little uh, blowers right here. You can uh, blow out any medical, any medical, any um, met metallic particles that have been uh, falling in here. So I'm going to clean out the inside here with this little blower. You don't want any of the metallic particles to be in there once you test your microwave. Okay, okay, now I've cleaned up the uh, interior here and I've re cleaned up the waveguide over there. And I, those dark marks over there are just where the arcing was on the interior wall there. But I turned the waveguide upside down so that uh, uh, it won't be. Well, it used to arc through there. There's not a hole there in the waveguide this time. So I got a, I got a honey bun there. I'm gonna put a honey bun in here and see what happens. Don't go away. I'm gonna shut this thing up here and see for 30 seconds here. Start. Well, it is a little bit too long for a honey bun. <laughs> it will be quite hot. But it uh, seems to be working fine here. Uh, it's, it's not arcing. So we're going to let it uh, time down. 
to zero here and see what happens here and then to make extend the time for something else there we go I got a hot anybody want a hot honey bun wow look at that honey bun you know what okay I'm not even gonna open this thing up this yeah, that's extremely hot hey looks like it worked pretty good here so I guess uh that does work clean up that wave guide there and this is a uh, Mars Bandit if you like this video subscribe button there below and I'll see you next time also let me give a special shout out to uh, youtuber Zach store 99 where I got this information about uh, cleaning up the uh, clean off the uh, wave guide there and uh, replacing it and if it gets too bad, I would imagine, see if you can, like you say, see if you can find a, a new one. But I, I flipped this one over, cleaned it off. I didn't use a dime because my hands are kind of large. I use a quarter, a, a, a scraper, clean off all the carbon deposits on the waveguide. But uh, there you have it. And uh, if you have an arcing of your microwave, try that before you go ahead and purchase a brand new one. Right now, I have put a cup of water in the microwave for a time of three minutes right here so just to make sure that the duration the cleaning would last longer than 30 seconds so we'll see here what happens here I'm not gonna sit here and watch it for <laughs> uh, two minutes here. I'm gonna put it on pause right here we got about five seconds left here with the three minute uh, time on the cup of water and let's see what we got here mm -hmm. okay it didn't it did not hey there's my just go give me some hot chocolate put in there and there we have it yes you can see the steam coming off the water okay well thank you once again and for the there's a lot of useful information out there on the uh, on this uh, problem here and, and the one I just used uh, Zector 99 was right on point there so and I will see you next time thanks for uh, watching and listening and if you enjoy this just click the red subscribe button and I'll see you next time